my name is Chris, and today I'm going to show how to change the blade on the uh, lawnmowers. Uh, we're going to come over to this rack first, and this is where all the blades are. They're numbered uh, 1 through uh, 33 right now. And your mower has a number on it, and you want to come and get the corresponding blade to your number. Um, today we're going to get 32. Uh, that's the one we're going to use. And you get the, the blade should be sharpened. We're going to get this. Then we're going to reach up in here and get a pair of gloves. These blades are very, very sharp. And uh, when you change that blade, you're going to be holding kind of the edge of it. So these will cut you, cut you bad. So make sure you wear your gloves. I'm going to go ahead and put my gloves on right now. And in one of these boxes are what we call scrapers. And this is to clean the grass from underneath of the mower. So there's my scraper. And then we're going to go over to this wall here. And we're going to get one of the box in wrenches here that will take off the mower. This is the 9 16th in that we're going to use to do the bolts from underneath. And then we're going to get a jack. And thus we jack up the mower so we can reach those blades. And then we're going to go out to the mower. We're going to take our jack and we're going to extend it as far as we can without it coming out. And we're going to stick it, we're going to lift our mower up and we're going to stick it under the neck. And I prefer to put it off to one side so it gives me a little bit more room to clear. I also like to stay organized, so I'll take my tools and I'll put them on the right side of me. Uh, if you wish to use the other side, that's quite all right. And at this point, we're going to just sit down. And underneath, we have two bolts that hold our blade on. So we're going to take our 916 box in wrench. And uh, I like to put the blade across this way so you can see both of the bolts. And then we would just take it, your wrench, and loosen the bolts. Usually a couple turns we'll get the nuts loose. And do each one. And then you kind of hold this assembly up. There's several pieces that are on here. And we'll just unscrew the nuts. And I like to stick them right between my legs. That way they don't get lost. And when we have that out, we'll drop this whole assembly. We'll have the old blade. We'll have this piece that the blade holds onto. And we have a little spacer. And then we have this disc that fits up into the mower. Those are the five pieces that you should pull out. Now, once you get the blade off, you want to take your scraper and you want to scrape underneath all the excess grass that builds up. Um, you want to scrape it out, just let it fall to the ground, and we'll pick that up later. Just make sure your mower is nice and clean for the next day. All right, when we get ready to uh, put it back together, it just goes in reverse order. So first of all, we're going to take this plate, and you can put them up one at a time if you like. I like to put three pieces together, it just saves a little time. So I take this, flip it over, and you can see the outline of the spacer. Lay the spacer in the dish part of the plate. And then we will take this piece and we'll lay it the flat end on top of the spacer. You want that rounded piece on the outside, as you can see. And then you would just stick that whole plate back on the bolts. All right, once we get those three pieces um, through the bolt holes, just kind of use your hand or your one finger to hold those pieces in there. Grab your new blade, stick it on, and then uh, you just hold the blade on the edge here. And then we're going to get our protective plate, and we'll put that on last. Once that's on, we'll hold that with our other finger. Reach down between your legs and grab one of your nuts. Screw that on. Grab the other nut. And we'll screw that on. Also, it's recommended to use a little WD 40 on those bolts occasionally because they will get kind of tight 
and uh, that kind of helps it and it also helps keep them clean. And then we take our 916 box in the wrench and we will just tighten them up. You don't have to cinch them down so tight that you can't do it, but you want to get them nice and snug. They won't fall off if you get them nice and snug, they'll, they'll stay on. And nice and stuck. And they're all done. We'll set our tools to the side. And then we'll come up. And we'll take our mower off the jack. Lower the jack. And then we'll replace these back in the proper place. Um, once you've cleaned your mower or changed the blade and cleaned it, you can take it and put it in the proper space where your team is. And then you'll come back with a dustpan and a broom. We'll clean up these clippings and we'll throw them in the uh, big trash can. So I want to say thanks for joining us. Uh, this concludes the tutorial on how to change your blade and just wish you uh, happy mowing.